Salutations and good morrow everyone and welcome back to another grounded update video where today we're going to be hopping in and I'm going to be showing you guys how to unlock and get to the newest burgle chip in the backyard. Yes, I'm talking the burgle chip that is up in the rotten stump. It's all the way up in this upper yard area right here. You guys can see it on the map right here. It blinking. There's a missing burgle chip that's up here and we are going to be making our way up there. Now you're going to need a couple things before you go and get this burgle chip guys. One, you are going to need to get yourself the assistant manager key card. In order to get that key card, you guys guessed you got to go over to the black ant hill. You got to fight the assistant manager and kill him. If you guys don't know where that is for all of you new players to ground it, it's over here underneath this area you go in either through right here or down here one of those two ant hill descents and the assistant manager is down in the base that is down in that lab once you have his key card what you need to do is you actually need to jump into the water so i'm going to run right over here really really fast and i'm going to take a jump into the water i'm going to show you guys this is one of the lab pieces that's in the pond that we couldn't access one of the rooms in before well guess what now we can access one of those rooms. It's underwater. Now, I currently made it so I can't die once I go underwater, but you guys, I would advise you have a pair of fin flops and at least a breathing tube, if or a gill tube, I should say, or a bubble helmet in order to get this one. Now, what you need to do is you need to run right over here. You need to jump into the water and look for this certain base that is right here. This is the base that you are looking for. You're looking for this abandoned base. It has a doorway right here that you can go ahead and enter through. You go right in here. You notice that this area is full of water and guess what? The entire base is full of water. You come to the right. You use the assistant manager key card right here and you press this button which opens up a random door that we've never seen before. So where you want to head now is over to the rotten stump. There's more stuff in here that you can go ahead and get like some rocks and things like that and some raw science back here but let's head to the stump now here we are at the rotten stump now what i want to say about this base guys is this is a very 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 dangerous broken apart lab in order to get to this lab is full of uh tiger mosquitoes around it there is a swarm of ticks all around it there is wolf spiders that are all around it there you can see the ticks the wolf spiders and all of that but what you're looking for is this tube that's right here i'm going to jump up on top of here for you guys so i can show you i'm right here in the oak this this not oak tree but underneath the rotten stump that is right here what you want to do is you want to kind of climb your way up here the best that you can and see if you can somehow get yourself a jump spot to jump up up to on top of this tube it's kind of a pain in the butt to be able to do it takes a couple tries to get used to here but as soon as you get it figured out you can get up here and drop down in here. Now, there's a couple other important things in here as well, including the recipe for the mantis kebab, but more on that in the mantis video. So let's go ahead and drop down in here, guys. You'll drop all the way down, and what you'll notice is you discovered that you are stuck in an abandoned lab that is definitely tipped over and destroyed. There's a door here that is locked. You can't get in there, and if you jump right over here, more on it, in, like I said, in another video, but there is a Mantis research note that's right there, really hard to find. Okay, so here we are, now that we've parkoured into here, we need to keep making our way across and up. There we go. We found the stump outpost is what it's called. But yeah, this is definitely just a jumping puzzle that you need to make your way all the way up through. One way or another, you'll make your way through it. It's hard It's hard to really get through this area because it is completely destroyed and it's definitely more of a jumping puzzle than most labs that we have. But they do have to, they did have to make it kind of tricky for us to be able to get in here, right? Okay. So yeah, after making your way all the way up here and making it up into this broken down section, we'll run across a couple different things here. Let me grab a torch. Just go ahead and pull that out right there. Very good. You'll notice one, you have a milk molar. So we'll go ahead and bust that down here. Get that broken up and gather that. Very nice. All right. Now you want to follow this path back here a little bit. And guess what? You're dropping down more. Following the raw science and not missing it like I just did. There we go. You're going to drop down a little bit more. Hopping your way across 
And now you want to jump over there somehow and get to this terminal to activate that, to open up that door. There is some water down here that you, well, you, you could go in if you want to. There's not really a reason to go in here, but if you want to, you can go in here. See, nothing, nothing in here, but you could go in here if you want to. Now you need to do the treacherous task of climbing yourself all the way back out to that area that you were in before. All I can say is, is that this is a little bit of a pain in the butt to do. Good luck and start climbing. You're going to have to do a lot of jumping. Start off by going over here, running up this branch that's here, jumping here, then jumping back up over here onto the computer, then jumping over there onto that computer, unlike what I just did, and then you should be able to get out from there. But I'll meet you guys back at the top because I'm not the best at jumping puzzles. Okay, so after climbing all the way back out through all of that junk that was down there, which sucked to jump up through, by the way, uh, you make your way back up over here and you want to make your way through all of this. I had to go into first person mode. I would advise first person mode for jumping puzzles. Okay, back down here, back down all the way down through door A, and you're going to fall right in here. And here is the burgle chip. This is the stump burgle chip. And don't forget to grab this chest while you're here. It gives you some free loot that's right here. You get some moth fuzz, some black ox parts, and some rust. So go ahead and just grab up all of that that you can. And that is pretty much everything that's in here besides some raw science. So you grab that, and now you want to run all the way back out following the path. So you could go through and break Break up all these marbles. I would suggest you guys do that as well to get yourself out some more resources before you guys make your way back out. Okay, making your way back out now. You just have kind of an annoying climb again, climbing on dirt this time in rocks instead of lab equipment, and you're slowly going to make your way out. There's a ton of quartzite in here. If you guys need it, go ahead and grab all of that. Just keep following your way all the way out over here and just follow the path around until you finally make your way out. There's a stump piece that's right here that you could climb up on, and slowly but surely you will make your way out all the way over here and up and up and over and out and there you are you are officially outside of the stump and now you just need to make your way all the way back to burgle for us to see what this chip unlocks okay let's just talk to burgle here and what we're going to do is we are going to give him the chip here you go burgle how you doing i found an auxiliary chip fantastic i got 5,000 raw signs for that let's say goodbye to burgle and we got the stump chips unlocked so let's go ahead and see what all that unlocked for us over in the science shop so first of all we got advanced building the ash cement for those of you who want to get ash cement this is how you get it you make charcoal dust with charcoal and then charcoal ash cement using rust charcoal dust and clay so there is that so you guys can go ahead and get that one from right there and then scrolling down you can get a couple other things like some girthscape signs and stuff like that but not a whole lot from that one quite yet so there might be one or two other quick things in here but not really a whole lot there's not a new um there's not a new cooking thing or anything like that a new cooking recipe book but anyway that is what and how you get the ash cement and how you guys can start building all of those new buildings once you make it and research it you should be allowed to start going and building all of those new building materials but guys that's gonna do it for me today thank you all so much for watching this one if you guys liked it hit that like button don't forget to subscribe and leave me a comment down below and and as always, I'll see all of you guys in the next one.